Greetings everyone. So today's featured camper is a 2023 Puma XLE. It's the 30DBSC. So Puma XLE 30DBSC. We're looking at 6,300 pounds, which is really light, especially since it sleeps 10 people. I, I see confl conflicting information. Some say nine, some say 10. So we'll find out when we get in there together. You're looking at 33 feet, seven inches. A couple of things to share on the outside. You do have a nice big powered awning. I forgot to look what length that was and I do apologize, but as you can see, it takes up, I don't know, 90% of the camper. So that is electric, has LED lights. You have outside speakers. You have an outside kitchen, which I'll show you in a minute. A nice big pass-through storage up here at the front. You have a electronic tongue jack and uh, electronic stabilizer jacks. You do have a heated, or I'm sorry, an enclosed underbelly. There's some other details. This is considered an extended season, and I'm gonna cheat off the sticker when we get up there here in just a second on what all that's featured. The flooring I do wanna point out is a one piece deck flooring, and that is a 25 year warranty on that. So before we go back to the outside kitchen, I wanna show you this. So this is extended seasons package. So you're getting residential insulation throughout, freshwater tank insulated for increased thermal performance, enclosed underbelly, and an upgraded 3,500 BTU furnace. So the furnace is 3,500, the AC is 13.5. It is a 50 amp service camper, so it is wired for a second AC if you would like to have one. Outside kitchen, we've got a small fridge. These are absolutely fantastic if you have kids. It's going to keep them from running in and out of the camper. It's also great if you have guests because you don't, like say you're all hanging out by the campfire, you don't have them traipsing in and out of the camper to get a cold drink. It's right there. Sink, washing grubby hands, preparing to cook, whatever you need. And you even have a little graystone griddle out here, which is nice. Spare tire on the back. Backup slash rear observation camera prepped. Literally means pop that off there, put the camera on, and you are done. I think that covers most of the stuff on the outside. You do have a spot to hook up a TV out here if you would like. I know that a lot of people like doing that this time of year, football season. I can't remember if I mentioned the outside speakers, but you do have your two outside speakers. And then we will start at the back of this camper which is actually the bunkhouse. It's a pretty cool camper. So you've got four bunks back here. The top bunks are rated at 300 pounds, so you've got no issues with weight there. And they even have their own little closet as well as a space down below. I say kids, but if you want to put this out at your property, you're a hunter, you've got room back here for your hunting buddies. They've got their own private room back here if they want. So it's kind of a universal space. You also uh, could use this just for adult friends that are visiting you while you're camping. Just outside there, you do have a couple of nice big storage areas right here. And here is your bathroom. So we have our toilet, sink with storage below it, as well as your medicine cabinet, nice big medicine cabinet, and then our stand-up shower that does have a nice moon roof in it, so you're not gonna have an issue with height. Also, max air vent to get rid of the steam and or stink so we've got four people sleeping in the back we now have our u-shaped dinette this is also going to turn into sleeping so you're going to fit a couple of people here uh let's see nice big tall slides i went blank there for a minute i apologize you've got a jackknife sofa so that will also turn into sleeping so you've got a couple of people there and then our kitchen, uh, you've got an 11, 11 cubic foot fridge, plenty of space for a week's worth of groceries, no problem at all, fridge freezer. You've got your three burner uh, graystone cooktop, everything works as it should. Glass top that serves as prep space, but when you fold that back, it's also a backsplash. You've got your graystone uh, stainless steel microwave. Storage down below your sink, a nice big stainless steel sink, and as you see, a large countertop area for your dishes, your serving, whatever you want, as well as some additional cabinetry up here. 
Directly in front of me now is our entertainment area. So you put a TV there on a swivel and you can watch that from anywhere in here. You've got that stereo right there that will control the inside and those outside speakers like we were talking. And then you've got some storage down below. Master bedroom is up here at the front of the camper. So we've got a queen size bed. This does fold up and allow you to store stuff underneath. And then you have really big nightstands on both sides with you, uh, regular charging on one side and USB and regular charging on the other side. So plenty of space for CPAP, iPhones, iPads, whatever you've got. You've got the his and her closets on both sides, as well as a little storage area up there. And you have a TV backer in the wall here, which means you can actually mount a TV here in the bedroom if you would like to. And you know what? Let's double check this. So we've got the one AC there. I'm thinking now that I said that from the outside, you do not have a spot for a second AC in here. So it is 50 amp service, but you only have the one AC because there's no spot in here. Yeah, so sorry about that. I said that wrong. So this is the 2023 Puma 30 DBSC. It is uh, featured in one of our, it's featured in our 2023 blowout sale. So as you see, you're looking at a retail price of 45575 and you've got our blowout price at 28999 So you're saving 16576 on this. And if you're looking at a, a payment, you're looking at 268 a month. As always, if you have any questions about anything I covered in here, you want to make fun of me for anything I said wrong in here, or there's another unit that you've seen on our website that you would like me to do a video on, please just drop a comment down below. I'd be more than happy to answer your question or go cover whatever camper you would like. As always, thank you so much for watching and have a fantastic day.